Well, residents in some apartments in the Memphis area are living in some bad conditions and still expected to pay rent. Now, yesterday, we told you about trash building up at the Willow Apartments in Parkway Village. We've also been following the ongoing problems with Pepper Tree Apartment tenants having to relocate. So our Brittany Moncrease spent the day in environmental court as a judge ruled immediate changes to both complexes to keep residents safe. Brittany, what you find out? Well, Rudy, neighbors who live next to the Willow Apartments in Parkway Village have shown me rat traps around their homes because of the trash problem. And it's an eye opener to a larger issue in the city of Memphis, which is housing. A judge stepped in to not only help here, but also at Pepper Tree Apartments in Whitehaven. You have to believe it to see it. Trash piles high and piles long. Residents at Willow Apartments have been living next to this for months. And over in Whitehaven, residents still waiting to be relocated after the federal government cut ties with Pepper Tree Apartments are living next to vacant units with fire and water damage. As apartment development becomes more vacant, we have to really begin to address more security concerns and other issues. So environmental courts summoned both apartments to status hearings Thursday. As of Tuesday, Memphis House Housing Authority has issued 193 vouchers to Pepper Tree residents. 71 have already moved out, with the remaining either in the processes of moving, inspection, or waiting to interview with Lumas, an organization providing relocation help. We want to make sure that it's done in a matter that not only moves people effectively and efficiently and doesn't disrupt their lives, but it also, for the remaining tenants, keeps them in a safe and sanitary environment. Environmental Court Special Master Marcus Ward says the more vacant units, the more opportunity for crime or incidents such as the fire that took place weeks ago at Pepper Tree. That's why they want to add more 24-7 security, maintain regular upkeep, and remove stairwells in vacant standalone units. And without the stairwells being removed, the opportunity for people to trespass onto the site creates a threat for the existing residents. All of which Judge Patrick Dandridge ordered and for Willow Apartments, the owners who filed for involuntary bankruptcy didn't show up in court, but Judge Dandridge was clear saying, I don't know if I can say this any louder. The city needs to get over there and clean this. He gave the city until next week to make progress on picking up the trash and also find the owners listed on the property. And War says the hope is for Pepper Tree to be fully vacant by the end of the year. Another hearing is scheduled in two weeks. Now, there was some confusion over who the actual owners of Willow Apartments are, but Judge Dandridge requested all parties back in court next Thursday. But Rudy, he says they'll keep coming to court each week until this is cleaned. I'm sure they will, Brittany. Thanks a lot. Lots more reporting to come on this in the days to come.